my success strategy is happiness great that is it if i do anything and everything with a happy mind with a happy uh, mind thought process and i definitely succeed in those things and i guess everyone should will be succeeding only if they are doing with a happy mind doing with negative emotions will definitely not is the definitely not going to lead you somewhere so always be happy make people around you happy and be happy as in you have to be satisfied and contented with whatever you're doing you should be happy with whatever you're doing so one should do with all of their passion so that will create happiness and that will definitely lead them to success amazing amazing and uh, uh, talking about uh, success obviously there would have been a lot of challenges in your life too how did you overcome these challenges in fact i will say mr jason i have faced challenges since the day i was born Mm-hmm. there were too many personal stories uh, at my family like since uh, as th- that many years ago people didn't want a girl child so then i am one of uh, those unwanted girl child but then so i have seen this since the day i was born but then yes i have like overcome everything because um, i love to smile i just love to keep on smiling every time and this nature of mine has overcome has helped me overcoming challenges every time the more i face difficulties the more i smile on it the more i laugh on it because i always say the like just like that saying that why me i always say try me i can do anything and everything and that is what that keeps me going because i have that never give up attitude since the beginning and i feel why to give up god has like made you able we are not born disabled by the god uh, by god's grace god has given us everything we can talk we can hear we can walk we can eat we can do everything so why to give up correct in fact one should not give up till the last breath just go on and go and on and on challenges should be faced in fact otherwise how will we come to know that what what is that that we cannot face we we should be knowing our weaknesses only then we will be able to reach to success unless there are no challenges absolutely if there are no hurdles if there are no speed breakers when we are driving just a straight road will also make us feel boring it will be monotonous in our lives it will make our lives routine so rather welcome all the challenges because challenges give, will give you a kick every time so you should look for challenges if you are not facing challenges you should look for challenges create challenges go for new things which will definitely like uh, lead you to challenges and then overcoming those challenges will lead you to success but then you need to have that never give up attitude with within you and it comes from within and it comes from within only if you have a passion of doing something yeah i think that's a good strategy if, if there, there is no challenges create challenges absolutely yeah, amazing amazing uh before closing the show if any three advices would you like to share with the audience who is going to start anything in their life or who is going to switch their career yes definitely i would uh, say a short story everybody must have heard about the deaf frog mm. these uh, frogs had gathered somewhere and they had to climb a tree and uh, everyone was shouting one of the frogs that don't climb it's impossible it's impossible and but then only one frog could make it because ultimately everybody came to know that this frog is deaf so one should be deaf to the negative uh, this thing whatever people are throwing negative ideas upon you that you not be able to you uh, do some certain thing so you should be deaf to those things you should be completely deaf just focus on your goal and moreover always keep your goal moving like as in if you have reached your goal you should take another goal it's not that you have reached one set your goal then you should stop there but you should keep moving and always i like one more thing i would like to say like wake up early that is the only funda of your life you should always wake up one hour early give time to meditation exercise and the life should be balanced if you are disciplined if you plan your day one day prior you will definitely be able to achieve whatever you have planned correct and always we should have long term plans for sure long term goals for sure but then keep small attainable achievable goals for every day and you but then again don't be like uh, don't be sad if you are not able to achieve those goals but then you should make it a point that you do it in the days coming ahead but yes first of all keep your life balanced with exercise meditation keep your will power strong that come what may you are going to achieve your goals and why you are going to achieve your goals is because work is the only rent that you you can pay to your mother earth and we right. are obliged to mother earth so completely go on working go on working go on working till your last breath because work is the only thing that we can give back 
Correct. So that is the least we can do. So continue doing it. Balance your life. Be disciplined and organize and plan your day one day ahead, one day prior. You will definitely uh, like reach the success. Amazing, amazing. Uh, thank you so much for sharing these uh, strategies. In fact, uh, these times nobody uh, share these strategies for free, but you have done it for free. So thanks a lot. Uh, all those people who are starting their career would be inspired by this show, uh, especially by the talk show today. Thank you so much, Ms. Preeti, for joining from India. Thank you so much. Thank you, Jason, for inviting me. Thank, thank you. you so much. Thank you. Thank you.